Welcome, everybody, to the Penalty Box segment. It is Wednesday. I am Lawrence Presman, co-founder of Wager Talk Media, owner of Wager Talk Sports Memo, and the Gold Sheet. I got two NHL bets to give out. Let's get straight into it. There's only three games tonight. Let's start with the Detroit Red Wings against the Colorado Avalanche. And there's only one way to look here, and that is to go over the total. These are two big, big, big time scoring hockey teams. Detroit is 34 and 26 to the over on the year. Colorado as well, 34 and 26 to the over. This Colorado Avs team can score and score at will. They've put up five goals three times in their last four games. They just beat Chicago 5 0. They beat Chicago 5 0 again. And uh, they beat Dallas 5-1. The game they lost, they allowed five goals. And uh, I think they might allow a bunch of goals tonight. This Detroit Red Wings team uh, can score. They put up an eight spot three games ago against Washington, a six spot against St. Louis. We see them regularly score more than four goals. And I really like that they're coming into this game after an offer. Game against Florida, they lost 4 nothing. They only shot the puck 21 times. I think we see a complete opposite from them tonight. Take over the total. Uh, before we get into the Ottawa-Anaheim game, I want to mention I had a shit night for my clients on Monday. I had a shit night for my clients on Tuesday. These things do happen. There are moments in time. I'm up double-digit profit in college basketball and NHL. I just can't seem to win on demand. I expect to have a huge night tonight. I have five cards, but guys, five plays. But guys, don't bother buying me tonight. I just don't want the stress of it all. I want, I'm going 5-0 and oh tonight. I want to do it quietly. We'll celebrate tomorrow uh, and get things righted. Okay, so Ottawa, Anaheim. Uh, Tarasenko just got traded a few hours ago. Uh, to the Florida Panthers, and initially you would think that would be a bad thing for Ottawa. The difference is they're playing Anaheim, and it looks like Anaheim is either about to make a big trade, including uh, Vetrano, or they'll hold back some players as they're about to embark on a sell-off as the trade deadline approaches. This is a really bad spot for the Anaheim Ducks tonight. Uh, I think they're going to be depleted. I think they're going to have a uh, uh, a roster with a bunch of guys nobody's ever heard of. Uh, and I think Ottawa wants to make a statement, at least the players do, after that trade. Uh, we saw Ottawa go gangbusters last year from around this point on till the end of the year. I think Ottawa uh, might do the same again this year. This is a prideful team led by a Kachuk. I expect them to win tonight, and I expect them to win in regulation. So take Ottawa in regulation. That's it for the penalty box segment. We'll see you all tomorrow. Lots of love, everybody. Let's kick some ass. Ciao.